it's Jenny from Mummy Mishaps and today I'm going to be showing you how to make homemade fish and chips using crisp and dry. Here are the ingredients to serve four people. I do recommend that you use Maris Piper potatoes to get the best chips possible. Pour the crisp and dry into a large non-stick pan. Taking care, use a thermometer and when the oil hits 200 degrees, add your chips. After 10 minutes of cooking, carefully remove your chips using a slotted spoon onto a plate lined with a kitchen towel to remove any excess oil. To prepare your batter, take a large bowl and pour in the flour, salt and pepper and make a well in the middle to pour in your sparkling water. Use a whisk and mix the batter well to make a smooth, thickish consistency. Once your oil has reached the ideal temperature for cooking fish, coat your fish in the batter and carefully place in the oil. Now preheat your oven to 100 degrees while the fish is cooking. Allow your fish to fry in the oil for about 3-4 to four minutes and then carefully using a slotted spoon remove each portion onto a plate lined with kitchen towel to remove any excess oil. Place the fish in the oven to keep hot while you heat the oil back up to 190 degrees to cook your chips for a last 4 minutes to ensure they're crispy on the outside but soft and fluffy in the middle. Thank you.